I won't allow you go anywhere. Why can't you share the room with me? What are you scared of? I am a married man. I can't sleep in the same room with you. Laura, where are you? We are going to be late. Where is this girl? There you are. I'll be with you shortly, mummy. I don't want you to be late to school. I'll put your school bag in the car. Okay, mummy. Why did you choose to sit at the back today? Nothing really. It's been long I sat here. Okay. Is daddy coming back today? He should. He called me this morning. Hey! My daddy is coming back today. I'll pick you up from school, okay? Okay, mummy. Be a good girl, okay? Love you, baby. Love you, mummy. Justin must be blind. How can he ignore a beautiful girl like me? He chose that ugly girl with big eyes, big lips and nose over me. Justin thinks he is smart. He can't get away with this. I am going to make his life miserable. You can't ignore me and go away with it. I'm going to tell him that the address changed so he should go to a different branch of Alpha Pharmaceuticals which is about 4 hours by road. I'll go alone to Alpha headquarters for the presentation. Are you sure of where you are going sir? Yes. Palms Avenue. That is a 4 hours drive. That can't be true. I have been a driver in this city for 6 years. I'm telling you the truth. The presentation is supposed to be by 10. How am I supposed to get there in 4 hours? This is 8.30 a.m. Hello Jane. How are you this morning? I'm fine ma. The scarves we were expecting just arrived. Oh. That's good. Please arrange them in the scarf section. Okay ma. Hello Lisa. Wow. First lady. It's such a surprise to see you. Welcome to my store. I told you on Sunday that I was going to come. Here I am. Yes, you said that. Can I try out few clothes and choose from them? Absolutely. I have many beautiful clothes you'll like. Hope you are constantly praying for your family. I wasn't before but right now I am. That's good. Please don't stop. The devil is out there to destroy families. He hates Christian homes and would do anything and everything to destroy it. Okay, first lady. I'll make sure I intensify my prayers. Thank you so much. We have spent two hours on the road. Beauty's line is switched off. What is really happening? Actually, the CEO is not available at the moment. He went to one of our branches. Why was that not communicated to me before getting here? We are sorry. Can you come back tomorrow? Okay. Dear Lord, thank you because you are my father. Thank you for being good to me and my family. I commit my family into your hands, Lord. Take absolute control of our lives in the name of Jesus. I pray, Lord, for my husband. No weapon formed against him shall prosper in Jesus' name. My husband is blessed and highly favored in Jesus' name. He finds favor in the sight of God and men in Jesus' name. Amen. I'll make sure I tell the MD that Justin didn't show up. You will be sacked, Justin. He must be having a bad day right now. He must be really lost. I'll go back to my hotel room and wait till tomorrow. We have arrived at your destination. Thank you so much. Hello, sir. A man named Justin is here from PMJ Company. He said he is here for a presentation. That is strange. I just told my secretary to tell them that the presentation would be here and not the headquarters. But now that he is here, please take him to the conference room. You can go ahead, Mr. Justin. By the way, that's a very nice suit. Thank you so much. From 2000 to 2020, the global maternal mortality ratio MMR declined by 34%. From 342 deaths to 223 deaths per 100,000 live births, according to UN interagency estimates. With this new discovery, the global maternal mortality rate will further decline from 223 to 50. That is a good one. We love the presentation. The contract is approved. Thank you so much, Chairman. Thank you, everyone. 
What a great presentation, Mr. Justin. Thank you, sir. Do you think you can work with us? Work with you? There is something about you that is different from any other person who have been coming here. We don't mind you working with us. I have a great job, sir. My family also needs me back home. The position available is the general manager position. You'll be giving official car and official house. It comes with a very good pay. Thank you so much for the offer. I'll think about it and get back to you, sir. All right. God is good. With all the evil plans of beauty, God showed up for me. I'm going straight to the airport. I'm going home. I miss my family. God forbid. I rebuke you all in Jesus' name. This one must be a Christian guy with a praying wife. Nonsense. Jane, I'm going to my daughter's school and going home afterwards. Okay, mom. So my husband is coming home today. He said he has a lot of gist for me. I can't wait to listen to them all. My husband is coming back today. I want to cook delicious meals for him. Do you mean my daddy? I mean my husband. Who is my daddy? Okay, your daddy who is my husband. I think I can call him my daddy too. No, mommy. Leave my daddy for me. I know we both miss him. Yes, we do. I want to change my clothes. I'm coming to join you in the kitchen. Thanks, baby. I should also change mine. Something is not right. Why didn't Justin call me? Is he still on the way? I don't even know if he is in this hotel or he went to another hotel. Well, I don't care. I'll go for the presentation tomorrow. That should be my husband. My daddy. Please stay in the kitchen. I'll be right back. Welcome back, my husband. How was your journey? You need to take a warm shower. You must be very hungry too. I'm cooking a special meal for you. Thank you, my darling wife. It was fine but strange. Please, were you praying for me? Everything that happened was a miracle. I have a lot to tell you. Really? Don't worry. I'll listen to everything. Laura has left the kitchen. Let me check the food I'm cooking. I'll be right back. Okay, darling. Daddy. I missed you. I missed you so much, my daughter. I missed you more. You promised me that you were going to come home early, but you traveled instead. I'm sorry, darling. I wasn't given prior notice. I'll make it up to you. Okay, Daddy. I really enjoyed the meal, darling. It was so delicious. Thanks, darling. I want to hear everything that happened. The imprint your official assignment I went for was with beauty. Bohu, that lady that had a crush on you before we got married. Yes, that one. I want to believe she planned it with the general manager who is her uncle. You don't mean it. She initially told me two reservations were made. Then she told me only one room was available and the hotel was fully booked. That lady is a demon sent from hell. No wonder I was hearing pray for your husband. Really? Yes. Leah won't stop saying it. First lady came to my store and told me the same thing. Most importantly, the Holy Spirit. I was reluctant at first, but later obeyed. I really thank God I did. Wow. No wonder, it was you praying for me. That girl wanted to destroy me. Thank God for your prayers. It is good to be obedient. Thank God I listened to God and the people he sent to me. My dear wife, thank God you did. You wouldn't believe we didn't come back together. I didn't see her at the presentation. She told me the address changed so she sent the address of one of their branches. It was a four hours drive. Wow. I got there and met the CEO himself. What are the odds of meeting the CEO in a small branch instead of the headquarters? I was allowed to take the presentation. He really liked it. The contract was approved and he offered me a job. Wow, wow, wow. He offered you a job. Yes, darling. He did. It's a general manager position with official car and house in a very beautiful city. The pay is also huge. 
But I don't know, darling. I can't leave you and Laura here. Who says we don't want to go with you? What about Laura's school and your store? It means it's time for my store to open a new outlet. It's time for growth, baby. What about Laura? We can enroll her in a very good school over there. I want us to be sure that God wants us to move, though. Not our will, but his will be done. Sure, babe. Let's pray about it tonight. Okay, babe. Hello, sir. Is it true that you went for the presentation alone? I got a mail from Beauty that I should go to one of the branches of Alpha Pharmaceuticals for the presentation. I didn't know she won't be coming. Who do you think you are and what are you trying to prove? Do you think you are better than anyone here? You were supposed to work with Beauty as a team. But I followed Beauty's instruction. Really? By getting the job done alone? Do you know Beauty is not back yet? She was told to come back today for the presentation. I'm sending her a mail to come back since you already did the job alone. But we got the approval. The CEO was pleased with the presentation. We got the approval, so, you want the accolades right? What is this really about but I don't understand this anymore. You know what, we don't need your services anymore. You are fired. You have no right to fire me. I quit. What, you quit? Yes. Justin, I only said that so he could beg me. He is the best guy we have in sales, I'm in trouble. I'm free, I am free, I am free from manipulation. After the prayers last night, my wife and I were convinced that I should take the job offer. Wow. God is so good. I'm going to my wife's store to share the good news. Babe, what are you doing here so early? Can you guess? You resigned. I was sacked. Can you imagine? What? You don't mean it. They actually made it easier for you. I left in grand style. He thought I was going to beg for the job. My love, I'm happy I married you. Thank you so much for not giving up on our love. Thank you for praying for me when I needed it the most. You are a special gift from God to me. You are going to make me cry. I'm also happy I married the best man in the world. Love you, baby. I love you too, my darling. I have sent a mail to Alpha Pharmaceuticals that I'm ready to work with them and they have responded. We leave in two weeks. Thank you, Jesus. You are the most beautiful woman in the world. You make my world beautiful. You are making me shy. I'm happy to have you in my life. I don't want us to be late to church. Let me check Laura. I told her to change the clothes she wore. Okay. This is a better outfit. Thanks, Mom. We are late. Let's go to church. The Bible says in 1 Timothy 2, 8, I desire therefore that the men pray everywhere, lifting up holy hands, without wrath and doubting. This new week, make sure you are consistent in prayer. According to the verse just read, you can pray anywhere. In your car, during lunch break, before you sleep, anywhere and everywhere you are. Make sure you communicate with God often. God bless you all for coming to church today. See you on Wednesday for Bible study. I'm so happy to have a praying wife. I'm going to take my prayer life very serious henceforth. We're also going to be praying together as a family every day. Glory to God. All my plans failed. I tried everything possible to get Justin's attention but he ignored me. He even resigned. I am doomed.